So Patrick, why don't you tell us a little bit about the event tonight for maybe the people who aren't here, maybe sell it for those people who aren't here. <laughs> Well, Wine Art and Music is a fundraiser for the Rotary Center for the Arts. Um, our concept this year, it's our, first an our fourth annual presentation of WAM. It's my first because I'm new here. Um, but the whole idea with WAM is we wanted to have that regional food, the regional um, wineries, the beverages, and, and the regional artists because we're the Art Center. We're the Rotary Center for the Arts. But, you know, culinary arts, winemaking, it's all arts as well. Um, this year we connected with Jennifer Schell and she has that lovely cookbook. Uh, Okay, let me get it right. It's the butcher, the baker, the wine and cheese maker. It's a little bit of a title, but it's perfect. It's great. She's, it's such a collaborative work, and it covers the entire region. So we connected with her, and we brought in you know a lot of the people from the book. And as you can see, it's just wineries and breweries and and you know the chefs from all over the area. So we had to bring in the artists as well. So we've got uh, musicians all over the building. There's you know roving stilt walkers. I'm sure you've been you know seen a few of those bouncing around. Um, it's just it's such a terrific night and everyone seems to be having a great time and the the, the bistro here at the Rotary Center for the Arts has uh, done all kinds of wine gelatos I don't know if you tried the Chardonnay gelato it is out of this world well I haven't tried that yet but uh, that's gonna be on the menu now what's the best thing about this event tonight Wham? Wham. Um, I just love being a life drawing model so it's nice to inspire other people open other people to um, to what's out there uh, in the world of art that for me that's it and I had some chocolate bread, which was fantastic. I was going to say, have you tried the wine gelato yet? Uh, I think we got some wine gelato given to us, but um, uh, it was great. I mean, anything like that is wonderful. When you, can, when you can have a little bit of decadence, why not? Well, thank you for joining me. Uh, first off, why don't you tell us a bit about the performance you were just involved with? Well, it's basically a fusion of, uh, of art, music, and dance with uh, two incredible professionals, Angela Botton and uh, Angel Jutsi. And I'm just fortunate enough to be able to uh, be the orchestra behind them, you know? It was, uh, it was an amazing experience and something I've never done before and something I don't think I've seen being done before. So it was very exciting. Maybe you could show your hands to the, uh, the camera and show. <laughs> Brilliant. I realized that when we were working on it that there was no way I was going to be able to wash brushes um, quick enough. Um, so I, I chose then to just work totally with my hands. What's the most important thing about uh, the Rotary Centre for the Arts? Why is it so important to Kelowna, in your opinion? Well, I think it um, uh, brings uh, people the energy together. There's things going on here all the time, different things, arts, music coming together. And I find, because I have a studio here, I, I find that it's a stimulus for me. I can shut my door and work, or I can come out and be around all the creative people. And it's the energy that you get from being around um, people, like-minded people who've got passion. How important is this for the Rotary Centre in terms of raising funds and making sure your operations go on? It's so important. I mean, this, this centre is, you know, the purpose is to serve the community, provide artists a place to work, place to live, place to just come in. We're open to everyone all the time. It doesn't have a lot of ways to raise revenue. So by having, you know, these kind of events, which we only do once or twice a year, it, it really impacts the bottom line. It makes it all easier for us to have our children's programming and, you know, make it easier for the artists to work here. Uh, it's just so important to help us cover our costs. We don't really like to call it a fundraiser because we just want it to be a party and for it to be fun and everyone to enjoy themselves. But that's essentially what it is. It's a fundraiser and, you know, it's really important to us. You've got everything here. You've got art, you've got music and you've got the wine and the food and now I'm going to wash my hands up and join all my friends and have food, music, art, uh, some glasses of wine, a little libation. I'll have a glow on my face in the end. I mean, it's just wonderful. One fabulous event and worth, I mean, absolutely you get a, a bang for your buck. It's, it's a fabulous event. Fantastic. Well, thank you for talking to us. Oh, thank you. Have a great night. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, maybe not.